Three reps? Three reps, easy as pie. Come on. Hello. Hola. And bonjour, everybody. This is Doug. And Matthew. From McCrow Bros Bodybuilding. MB3. Today is back day, which starts with deadlifts. Yeah, last week we did, if you saw the video, um, rack pulls, just the top of the movement. Now we're working on, we decided to do like, what was six sets of three with the weight we could handle, we thought we could handle, and here we go. I think I did about 365, and here's Doug with his first weight at 365. Oh boy, you'll see how it goes. Oh, rounded oh. back. Oh, that was a struggle. <laughs> That's all right. That was oh, the let's see. I might have to lower the weight. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'll see what he has to say right here. I had a shaky start, but I'm about to stick the landing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so he's going in with a positive attitude. Here we go, 315, yep. three reps. And uh, so that was our oh, rep oh. scheme, six sets yeah. of three reps, and we did it at the beginning of our workout oh. where we have oh. the most energy. Yeah, and also, oh. if you do, we used to do deadlifts at the end of the workout. <laughs> we can't do that anymore because, I mean, That's more like it. it uses so much I lower back that yeah, if we do that. any other three back reps. exercise, our back three just reps. gets rounded. And same with... Doing the deadlifts, then our back gets tired. So then the rest of the workout, like doing bent over rows or something, is kind of out of the question. And if you didn't notice, we're actually uh, doing these deadlifts in our socks. Come just to uh, try to get a better center of gravity. Maybe pull them up a little easier. Yeah, we're just experimenting. And same with the stance. It's a little wider sumo-esque stance here. Here we go. And we both kind of like the way it feels. It's just something different, I think. Oh. Yeah, and uh, it gets us excited, I guess, to deadlift oh, again yeah. because it's something new and it's not just the same over and over, like, te ah, I can't even think of the word. <laughs> yeah, and hitting this with a wider stance also yeah. hits a lot more of the inner, like, thigh area. Yeah, so we're trying to make our legs a little thicker. Maybe that'll help. Yep. I'm not sure what's taking so long in this set. Oh, there's this guy that was behind us again the whole time just watching us talking to us. So. We got footage, a lot of him talking, yapping away. So I think we're trying to hide the camera because he's just like, I don't know. Anyway, this is this is the last set. We just showed you a couple of the sets of this. Six sets of three. Here you go, three reps. So now that we're done uh, targeting that Christmas tree action after Good. this set, then we'll move on to the lats. Oh. Last yeah, one. let's see here. <laughs> I don't know what we actually did next. There, Doug's finished up with 315. Oh, 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 is that 315? Then we just had to go T bar oh, rows. We haven't done this forever. And see, we're just doing it's not a big range of motion, but I mean, that's all you got. And doing it kind of heavyweight for us. We just never usually do T bar rows. I tell you what, I was amazed that when you get a good stretch and go. pull up and squeeze, my lats were on fire. <laughs> I know. I, Come on. Like you see it with our stance is more oh. standing straight up, so you Come think on. it's just using a lot of traps and upper back. But the whole lats were just burning here. Like, I think it's just a new exercise to us. <laughs> so it ended up working real well. Oh, gee. I forgot we had this. Here's oh. a little, something for your pl oh. <laughs> view and pleasure. Enjoy the show, the off season. Yeah, we just, it was, <laughs> this is actually just for us to see what it looked like, and I think I left it in here, but oh well. Oh, yeah, there's nobody in the gym, so we figured why not, because you could just feel, like, the contraction. Here we go. Like, I want to see what it looks like. Yeah. I mean, after doing all this hard work, you don't, I want to actually see what we're working on. I've, so much lately, I have been oh. working out with, like, a sweatshirt on. <laughs> So I don't know what my progress is doing. Sweet. Now, mind yeah. you, I'm not Cody Montgomery just winning the 13 nationals. But anyway, after that, we moved on to oh. the high rows. <laughs> yep. As you can see, we tried a different grip holding the actual machine itself just to have a wider grip. Just hits at a different angle. It's something different. 
Now during this set, I almost got hit with a hit with the weight like three times just because I was only paying attention to the camera view. So you guys are welcome. <laughs> yeah, he's got some artsy view. Oh, he almost gets hit there. Here's Doug. I set of this. I think we only did maybe two, two to three sets with this grip, and then we switched to the inner grip, which we may have on tape. Yep. So well. all in all, <laughs> there's Matthew I'm trying to hide. Woo! All in all, so far, well, actually, um, speaking for the whole workout, is really yeah. intense and uh, a great, <laughs> a great off-season classic workout. Yeah. Now we're going to hit him individually here. It's kind of the same movement as the T-bar row, just individual here. Now, I'm sure you've heard it in other people's videos that if you do all your movements where you're using both at the same time, you'll build muscle imbalances, which is why we target the last just one at a time with this. Yep, and I believe this finished off our workout. You'll see Doug uh, finish off here. And usually we um, do these dumbbell rows on a bench here we go. so we're lower down this time we like the t-bar rows kind of stood more st straight up <laughs> but uh, sorry i had a fluff there but uh so this is just again hitting it from a different angle than usual oh, oh yeah so we finished off with Here's Doug doing um, just the regular standard grip pull downs, and I think I finished with a close grip wow. pull down. Yep, we wanted to hit some of the pulling row motions and some of the pull downs so we can hit the back at all angles. Yeah, I think we really. Oh, here, it's like a medium grip. So, anyway, that was a whole back workout. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Speaking of that, if you do, you can like this video, you can throw down an old comment. You can subscribe. Remember, guys, there's always one on the way. So, stay tuned. The hardest part of this whole thing is not what I'm doing right now, but with just unracking it. Like, the weight on my back, I'm not used to. It but, um, so we both did this. I think this was like 14 sets of squats we ended up doing. This is just a quick.